Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how you're going to make a PS5 controller works with Assassin's, Assassin's Creed Mirage, okay? So let's say uh, this is a cracked game, okay? It's from Fit Girl Repack. So yeah, it's from Fit Girl Repack, but um, when you connect your PS5 controller via Bluetooth, it doesn't detect anything, okay? Even if you install Steam, add a non-Steam games, it will not work okay on crack games so in this video i'm gonna show you how you're gonna make this works okay so what you wanna do you wanna exit steam okay make sure that steam is exit all right next thing what you wanna do you wanna go to google and search for ds4 windows all right and you wanna download it from github the one which has Ryo Chan seven name. All right, click this, and first thing first, you have to install the .NET eight runtime, according to whatever you have, thirty two bits or sixty four bits. So I'm gonna click this, and then I'm gonna check the zip file. Okay, I'm gonna click on DS four zip right there all right so first thing first what you want to do you're gonna run this windows desktop runtime all right so you'll need of this to run the ds4 windows all right right here what you want to do you go to winrar and extract files okay once you've done that, guys, make sure that you just double click this. Alright, double click DS4 Windows.exe and choose program folder. Okay. And if it asks for enable devices mapper support, choose this support for DualSense PS5 controller. Okay. Alright, tick the first one, second one. DualSense device support. This is for PS5 controllers. All right, then close and make sure that you install the first one, which is this one. So the driver. Install the driver. All right, hit next. I agree. Next, install. And as for the second one on the step two, you might want to skip that because this one is for Windows Server. All right. Uh, yeah. Okay. Click finish. And right there, guys, um, I'm going to show you now we're going to when I um, go to Bluetooth. Okay. So you're going to enable Bluetooth. Click more settings. And then click add a device all right and before we do that you might want to okay you might want to use a usb dongle a bluetooth dongle if your pc if your motherboard doesn't support bluetooth inbuilt bluetooth if your motherboard does not have the capacity to run bluetooth okay you might want to use uh via you might want to use a ps5 controller wired okay all right so i'm gonna enter the uh, ps5 controller into the pairing mode all right so here's a controller guys here's a dual sense 5 controller so you'll have to press this button and this at the same time okay press and hold until you see the blue led light start flashing like that okay once you've done that i'm gonna see the lights starts to flash i'm gonna click bluetooth and here detected i'm gonna click connect and once it connected you're gonna see you're you're gonna notice on the ps5 controllers uh, light the led light will be will become solid okay now right here just click start button before you click start click on settings device option and make sure that uh dual sense controller support is ticked all right then go back to controllers and click on start okay as you can see it detected dual sense controller and uh with the status with a bluetooth icon 
right next to it next thing uh make sure that steam is closed uh you might want to remove the game from steam all right if you added the game like add a non steam game all right so i'm gonna manage uh remove non steam game from your library okay and then close out of steam exit steam make sure that steam is closed right so that it doesn't mess with ds4 right so now just double click this uh, good you're ready to go guys you're ready to rock and your ps5 control will now act like an xbox control and you will be you will be able to use your ps5 control on any games even crack games like fit girl repack duty repack and much more okay thank thank you so much for watching guys